Hello, I'm Eric Garza from San Antonio, Texas. I'm 14 in the 8th grade and go to School of Science and Technology. This is my Google Science Fair entry. When I grow up, I want to be in the medical field as either a surgeon or an anesthesiologist. Winning this would mean that I would get a scholarship and be able to go to a good college. Now on to my science project. My question was, do businesses manipulate the results of a soda taste test by changing small variables? If a store-bought soda's variables are changed during a soda taste test while competing against a major brand, then people will like the store-bought brand better. For my experiment, first what I did was my control test. I told the participants which soda is which and didn't change any variables. For the second test, I put the store-bought soda in a cooler for 30 minutes. The store-bought soda wasn't that cold but noticeable if you were looking at it. Now this time, I told my participants which was store brand and which one was a major brand, but it was the other way around. On my control test, 11 out of 15 people liked the major brand better, but on my second test, the one in which I manipulated the results by changing small variables, people liked the store brand better and they thought they were picking the major brand. As you can see on my graph here, I did 15 participants for my control test and 20 on my second. Now my observations. What I saw was when people are told which drink is the major brand, they tend to choose that one. Also, most people chose the first one they drank most of the time. Well now my conclusions. It looks like businesses are manipulating soda taste tests shown on TV by changing variables. They probably make their soda colder than the store brand so that people pick their drink more on camera.